Are you over? 12. Okay. <coughs> Ready? Okay, April 12, 2016, Queen's Vet. Now, this old dog, 10 years old male, not neutered, multi cross with poodle, comes in for the complaint of, of uh, what? Itchiness? Yeah, itchiness. Which part? Uh, on the legs. Legs, biting yeah, the legs, you can see. The stand of four legs are biting the legs. Yeah. Okay, some more. The neck. The neck. The neck, we can see, come relax first. Yep. There, you see, just, just okay. relax. Okay. Yeah, just video yeah. the neck. The yeah. neck, you see, the face is actually here. Yeah. Yeah. And almost bored. Are you sure it's only one year? One year ago? Yeah, one year ago. You can see this dog is scratching and here. Yeah. The, the dog. Has it been to the groomer? Uh, no. no. Pigmentation and scales. Mm. Pigmentation. Okay, then you see the ears. No. The ears. Originally, was there any crust? Uh, any no. crusted originally? No. Uh, so we can see here, the ear canal is closed. Eh? Only there's a hole here. But the perineal hole. Then we see the other ear. We, we come to this side first. We see the other ear. Okay, you see the other ear, yeah. and uh, it's, it's due to scratching, this face is due to scratching and it's all black. And, and several months later, right? Yeah. No, surprisingly this ear actually is quite clean, because mm -hmm. most of the whole ear is black. Mm -hmm. So you can see that, but there are crusts here, mm -hmm. so you might have scabies sometimes. Did you apply something? No. Mm -hmm. No, do you apply any shampoo or anything? No. no. no Medicated no, no, shampoo? No, no, no. So normally this ear canal is quite 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 big now. No. I will just check. No. Any smell anything? No. <coughs> okay, so we know. Wait, am I? Okay, so we know from this uh, examination that deep inside the canal, the ear canal is vertical and horizontal. So the vertical canal is okay. It's a horizontal canal. Where's my pen? Okay. So I just draw. Uh, just sure I draw the owner. Come this side. Maybe behind me. Normally be behind me. So the ear canal right there. Uh, so. The ear canal mm. is a tube right here, yeah? mm. vertical tube, and then there's a horizontal tube. Okay, the VC vertical canal, mm. HC is horizontal canal. Mm. Now, in this dog, over the years, many years, uh, this part is, is very heavy, right? Mm. The hairy, yeah, yeah, yeah. very <coughs> hairy. So he he traps traps the water and all, yeah. and uh, there's no air, no mm. ventilation. Mm. So this part becomes infected. Ulcers deep in, uh, mm. which you can't see. I'm sure you'll put powder in, right? Uh, oh, did you go to the groomer? No, no seldom. Mm. So, anyway, this part mm. is where you can go. So, when you put a cotton mm. butt in, when it goes mm. further in, it's very uh, oh. painful. painful. Touch the, uh, the horizontal canal side to junction. Uh. Mm. So, so when, when the ear is very painful, of course, the dog scratches. Uh, when yeah. you so the dog will scratch up with yeah. So the dog will use the leg, the back leg to scratch the side here. So the hair is gone, mm. both sides. And oh. then it scratch the neck. So the neck mm. also is hairless. Okay. Then this is only one. Ah, uh, now he's very angry with me. <laughs> so this is only one one problem <coughs> causing the scratching. Okay. Now okay. the other problem is this dog has fungus. Mm. Uh, okay. Fungus is the ring room now. I take a take a sample of the mm. hair. Now come, you see here, there. Yeah. So I show the owner. Mm. Now, just, just uh, show me the normal hair. Just turn a bit first. The normal hair, no, this one probably don't have. Just, you just look at the hair. Um, okay, wait. No, let's give one hair first. Yeah. Okay, focus. Focus very well. Huh? So I told the owner the normal hair normally, normally is, there is nothing there, you see, on the, on the shelf. Huh? But once this infected with fungus, the ring won't touch me. Just shut the focus bit. Give me this side with the third, this other one. This one, this side. Uh. You can see the camera? Yes, no. Okay, this one has been full of ring worm. 
these are the growth of the yeah. high fear equation. Someone, someone, mm -hmm. someone, someone, someone follow so, so, uh, uh, You can see some of them are more, more clearer. Now someone will follow it. Uh, we follow, oh yeah, we follow, see the other hair. So this is the normal hair there. Eh? Mm. Normal hair very clear, nothing. Eh? They go follow this one. Oh, slowly, slowly. Eh? This is the normal hair. Okay, someone? Normal hair normally don't have outgrowth. Eh? But then it shows the ring bone hair there. Eh? A lot of this small, small. Mm. Yeah, from the one. Okay. So this is confirmed uh, ring bone. So there are things that we culture it. We culture it. So we take the hair and culture it, mm. and uh, then uh, that is to confirm it. Okay, now the treatment. Mm. The treatment first of all will shave the dog bob, mm. bob so that uh, all the infected hair will be will be uh, removed. Mm. Then after that, then we will give the dog uh, tablets okay. and a wash and a cream, mm. and. Uh, so this takes about a month to okay. do every day, the owner does a bit. Mm. They say for example he does half the body first. Mm. Half. So it is. Oh. You know. Wait, then, what is that? Is that the huh? If half the second of the No, the second day we'll do the other half. Oh, okay, okay. So we'll do that for about one month. Mm. Then any uh, any fungal tablets and antibiotics as well. Mm. Well, most of them also have fungal uh, bacteria. Okay. Then they, they call it the yeast. Yeast is another infection. Mm. It, normally everything is there because mm. it cannot be just one alone for this dog. If it's only alone fungus, uh, if you see my website, they are all, you will see that the dog has mm. rings. There is mm. a ring room, uh, there's mm. a ring. Uh. So but yours is generalized. And then there will be mites, the demodex mites then. So mm. because the dog is uh, stressed out. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Okay, so now we see the below, huh? mm. the lower part, not just below here, you see here. I see here the dog has been biting here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, below. Now this part, on well, this part below, mm. is probably another cause of yeah. the problem. Huh? Mm. So you're biting her. So now I will check the inner sac. Mm. Inner sac. Wait, let me check the inner sac. The oil glands. Huh? So, so in, in, in short, ear, ear infection is one, mm. of course. And then the other one is uh, mm. the, the inner sac. Mm. Inner set is the product infected. They bite you or not? No, no, no. See, you can tail biting and see, they chase a yeah, yeah. round of the backside on the floor. Bite. Bite the tail, bite tail biting. Yeah, yeah. One tail biting the ball is one, one cause. You see the inner gland. Have you ever squeezed on him? Have you ever done that last time? No, no. So, one of the reasons. Yeah. He might have rubbed his backside on the floor. Do you on the floor? Yeah, yeah sometimes he rubbed. Rubbed on, scootering on you can see, <coughs> you can see the oil is very thick. Yeah. Oh, very thick. This is very long ago. So part of it has, he has been able to to get it out under the floor by scootering, mm -hmm. and some part he can't. So yeah. they bite. So some of the bite below also. Yeah. <coughs> so we will shape board and then uh, mm. then we will start the cleaning one. Okay. So this one will take photo. Uh? Yeah. 